Hello and welcome back to the Massimo Peluso channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about university and you know, I'm very happy because I am a week away from finishing second year. Thank God. It's been hard, but I got through it somehow, don't know how, got through it. So basically, I'm just going to talk more about that and like what I learned, how I found it, what I got, you know, sort of that sort of thing. Um, so first semester, psychology and sociology, uh, BSc. So first semester, I learned about self and society. That was one of the units which I studied, I think, on Thursdays, I learned on Thursdays. And that was, it's clue in the name, about, you know, individuals in society. So about like gender roles, gender norms, um, you know, gender identity, um, you know, kind of just fitting into society, um, groups in society, just kind of like that. It's just basically sociology to a T, really. Um, it was quite, it was straightforward. That's what I'm going to say. Like, I was going to say easy, but it was straightforward. Um, and for that, we had a 2000 word essay and that was it. And then another module we did was individual differences. See, that was one of my like favorites, I think, individual differences. And that was very, very, it was very technical and very quite difficult at the time, but I enjoyed it. It was just a, basically about like the different, um, you know, areas of like intelligence, like the nine, um, you know, areas of intelligence, emotional intelligence and stuff like that. Um, about like autism, I think we learned about autism. Um, I can't remember, it's so long ago now. Um, about disorders and stuff like that. Um, and just basically an individual person, how they're different from each other. And for that, we had a exam. It was like a multiple choice exam, which was 50% and the other 50% was a 2000 word essay. Um, and that was really good. I really, honestly really enjoyed that module. I did five modules just quickly in first semester. The third one we did was, and this was a 30 credit module, so we did it for the entire second year, and that was research methods. And if you've studied psychology and or sociology, you know the struggle and you know like how bad research methods can be. Like it's so easy, it's like boring. Like does that make sense? Like a lot of it is quite straightforward and it's like, I know, like I know that from like my already like stuff I've already learned, and it's just like boring as. But anyway, we did that. You know what it is. You know, like measurements and how to measure this central tendency, like just all of that really. On anyway, um, so the fourth module we studied was about youth resistance and social control or something. I think I think that's the exact title. And that was just about like riots. Oh, that's, that was a really good module actually. That was first semester, obviously. That was a really good module. And we learned about like the riots, the London riots, and just, and you know, people just going against, you know, society and, you know, things like that. And it was really good, really interesting. I really liked the lecture of this one in particular. And yeah, it was, it was just about members of society not fitting in and, you know, stuff like that. Again, it was quite straightforward, but, really enjoyable and a lot of discussion. And last but not least, the fifth module we did is, let me try and remember now, oh, um, development across the lifespan, which is another psychology module. And that was, again, hard, but really good. And that was just basically, as you can gather by the title, the development of each stage is, you know, like, you know, what age do babies learn to walk and, and talk and, development and all these you learn a lot of studies for this like cat scans and you know just like how the brain looks at different stages of development and different disorders that was first semester overall for first semester i got i think for the modules a two one uh and three two twos yeah and then obviously the fifth module i'm still doing so it's kind of like um a continuation uh, of that kind of thing like you do it for the whole year so I haven't got the grades back for that um so that's that that's first semester done and dusted by um overall I'm quite happy with my results but kind of like annoyed at the same time like I wish because there were like mid two twos sort of thing kind of low two twos and so it's like annoying I was like I wish I got more but it is what it is you know they take my best 90 credits I think I don't know if I've said this but with regards to results for second year so typically with courses 
your grades are from second and third year. First year is kind of redundant. You don't, your grades aren't contributed. I know this one girl who studies media and she said her first year does count, but mine doesn't, you know, in that case. But um, yeah, so for second year, they take 90 credits from 120 credits. So your best 90 credits of 120 is used. So if you do like really poorly on a module or two, it's kind of like disregarded. So it could be two 15 credit modules or a 30 module. I do 130. So it would either be 130 or 215. And so that's quite good. Um, it's quite fair. It's like, you know, cause like your poor, your most poorest or two poorest modules are written off, you know, cause it may be a module that you don't really care about or really interested in, which was research methods for me. So that's probably re regarded, disregarded, but you know, I, I did quite well, I feel. <laughs> um, and then obviously I think they said that second year is only one third of your overall result. So your third year is your biggest one, obviously like the dissertation and just everything else is the biggest contributor. But yeah, for second semester, which I felt like was more of a drag, like it was really, really hard to, to get myself motivated to do the work, to turn up, honestly. Um, I don't know, maybe it's just the whole now one year anniversary of doing it, of being remote, like learning remotely was a lot. And you know, it took its toll, but I got there in the end, thank God. So the modules, there was three modules I learned and I studied, um, let me try and think, obviously research methods continued. And then the other two include, um, let me try and get the title, if I can actually remember. Um, Sociology of, of every day, I think it's called, and that was literally everything, like how, how pets are, um, you know, how they're in society and like, and you know, just how people can contribute in social situations. And it, honestly, like it's not easy, but it was quite straightforward, the module. Um, yeah, that was, it was, a, it was okay module. Um, I kind of just, I've kind of forgot about it really. The module was called, and it's called Social and Cultural Understanding of Arts and Others. And, sorry, I had to remember. And that was just about like language, how language can translate between cultures and, you know, communication and attribution and stuff like that. That was quite difficult, I'm not gonna lie. Even the essay was difficult, 2000 word essay. That was difficult. Um, I'm still yet to get my results back, but all my results are actually for second year. Uh, for some second semester so we'll see what happens there but yeah it, it was second year was hard like i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna lie to you like it was difficult and i'm so, honestly so proud of myself for finishing like don't know how i did it like i was even before doing the doing the essay i was like imagine like can i do this am i gonna like you doubt yourself you get in your head but i did it thank god um and considering the year we've had and the struggle i had and you know, I'm, I'm, I'm proud of myself, you know, for sticking at it, continuing it, doing it. So yeah, um, but yeah, the reason why I like my course is because it, it's a mix. You On Monday, you'll learn psychology, a psychology module, and then Thursday, you'll learn a sociology module. It's like, if you like range in your week, a variety in your week, like I do highly recommend doing a, jo uh, a joint honours, doing two subjects, because it just does really mix up your week and especially if you're like me undecided you don't know what what modules to choose sorry what subject to choose then it's perfect you know um it can help you um so yeah that's kind of it really um i'm really happy i finished second year and let's roll on third i'm gonna enjoy my summer i'm gonna relax and enjoy myself and hopefully third year doesn't you know like beat me up <laughs> and it's not too hard because i've heard from my friends because Obviously, I'm. A, I did a year extra, so my friends are a year ahead. Um, I hope that, um, and they were saying to me that it was quite hard. So, hopefully, that is not the case for me, but it probably will be. Um, over this, over the summer, I'm going to think about my dissertation title, which you're recommended to do over the year two summer. So I'll be doing that, and I will be yeah not thinking much about uni until September. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope I've helped in some way or you know kind of gave you an idea if you're considering this course or if you're in first year and you're wondering what second year is going to be like etc hope it's helped so yeah please give it a like and subscribe and follow me on my instagram and all my social media channels and i'll see you in my next video